Hello, today I'm talking with Plan Grid, a company with a green iPad app for the construction industry. I'm here with Ryan Sutton G, and he is CEO of Plan Grid. Ryan, can you start by explaining exactly what Plan Grid does? What is the problem you're solving? I was a construction engineer, um, and you know, I was working on projects like hospitals, for example, that just had an ungodly amount of paper like this. So this is actually only one tenth of the total amount of paper used to build a hospital um, for one set of information. And there were over 100 people that had all 10 volumes. That's a lot of paper. Yeah, in fact, um, on hospitals, they can easily have budgets of up to a million dollars just for printing this stuff out. A million dollars just for the paper. Yeah. Um, and our estimate is like $4 billion a year was spent in 2011 just on paper in construction alone, um, which is ridiculous. It's an insane amount of paper and it's the same amount of trees. So then when the iPad came out, I was like, oh my God, this is going to be the thing that changes it. Right. So Plan Grid puts these enormous blueprints on the iPad. Right. So we've got. Um, the capability of putting up to 60,000 sheets of paper into one iPad, um, which is obviously a lot of construction projects. Even this was only around 8,000 sheets. So, so you're doing it using the cloud? Right. So the idea is instead of having to update you know, 100 different sets across a construction site, which you can imagine is quite impossible, um, you just update one set in the cloud and everything will wirelessly sync to all the iPads in the so field. I'd like to introduce Tracy Young. She's one of the co-founders of Plan Grid, and she's going to give us a demo on exactly what Plan Grid does. So there's the Plan Grid app. I'm just going to head in here. So you're immediately brought into the project screen. Projects on the device means our users can be on the job site without internet connectivity or Wi-Fi and still have access to all their drawings. So notice how fast it renders. I'm just going to head into one of these. This looks interesting. It's actually the Moffitt hanger. It's public domain drawings. Head in here. And whatever you want to do with blueprints as far as marking up, our users like to highlight things and maybe snap a photo. It's funny, people said that they didn't want to didn't want to use a camera. Who would want to use a camera on an iPad? And we know 17 million people who do. So I can identify a field issue and then immediately send it out. The step alone as an engineer for a, for a general contractor would have taken me 30 minutes. I mean, I'd have to print it out, snap a photo, go out to the job site, um, scan it back in, and then send it out. This is instant. And tell us about your competition. There must be hundreds of iPad apps for the construction industry, and certainly dozens for this type of thing, getting the blueprints onto the iPad. Why is Plan right. Grid's solution better? Um, so there are a lot of PDF reading apps, but they're not really specifically tailored to the construction industry. And I think the one thing that Plan Grid does better than anyone else is that um, the iPad itself is, although it's beautiful and it's great at, at at consuming content in a mobile way, um, it's not very computationally powerful. Um, and what we've done is by leveraging the cloud, not only are we using it for distribution, which is the most common usage of the cloud for files, we're also leveraging it for computation. And so we preload every drawing that you put on there up front one time on our powerful computers on the, on the back end, so that when you send them to your iPad, there's not a lot of loading, and which is why you can see it's just it's so much more fluid than any other way of looking at blueprints. Um, there are other things we're leveraging with the cloud too. As I mentioned, you took a photo and you can pin it right to the plan. Well, we're capturing that data and sort of like how Instagram does for photos, we're automatically uploading that back to our cloud with you know, who took it, what sheet they took it on, what time and day they took it. So you know, a common problem in construction is months you know, ago, you'll, there'll be some dispute and some argument as to what the state of the building was. And document that is usually quite hard. But with Plan Grid, if you're continually taking photos, it's very easy to search through all that. All this stuff that has been automatically uploaded without any data input on your part, you can prove, oh, look, three months ago, this was what it looked like right here. You can offer quantified savings. Exactly. So there are the hard cost savings of reducing paper, um, and there are also the soft cost savings of saving time and reducing rework as well. And what about Silicon Valley specifically? Can you talk about any specific projects you're doing down there? Right. We are being used on um, you know, by very large Silicon Valley companies that everyone is familiar with to build some of their office spaces. People in Silicon Valley are always up with tech, so it's kind of, they're the early adopters in everything, including us. We've seen a lot of growth in, in the healthcare sector. Uh, on several hospitals, we've reduced in paper consumption by 90%. Um, so that's a lot of money and a lot of trees saved. You could fill up all of downtown San Francisco with paper. That's how many trees we're saving. Mm -hmm.